Good evening pepper lovers and welcome to a new series on my channel called Cooking with Isotope. Today we're going to be making some really spicy rum and raisin cookies. Um, I'm going to be using powder that Tess gave to me, Tess's messes on the discord. Um, it's powdered Bucciolokia chocolate. Um, it's really hot, I've already had a couple of spoonfuls of it. Um, it really lit up a pot noodle for me. So today I'm going to be putting it in some cookies and I'm also going to be making some non-spicy cookies as well so that if these go terribly wrong we could still enjoy some cookies. So I'm going to be doing rum and raisin with a bit of a twist so I'm going to be adding some chocolate. And pepperoni as your... Yeah. So this is my rum mixture. I've, got, I've also got a white fatale pepper sliced up and put in there just because I thought it might give it some sweetness and it might add some sweetness to the rum as well. And some spiciness. <laughs> obviously, <laughs> obviously we're going to be putting some spice in it. Um, yeah, we've got some chocolate chips that we've cut up. We've cut up basically just a plain old milk chocolate bar. In these bowls I've got the butter and sugar mixture ready to be mixed together into a little paste, as the recipe says. Yeah, we're just basically going to cream together this butter and sugar um, until we get a nice creamy butter and sugar mixture. I don't know what to tell you, it's just going to look like creamy butter and sugar. And yours is combined nicely. So I'm going to get this lovely delightful mixture and I'm going to put it in the saucepan and I'm just going to bring it up to this boil. Yeah, I'm just going to whack the heat on, put it on medium heat, cook it down until there's no liquid left. So this is just a mixture of water, rum and peppers and raisins. So, delightful mixture. Are you going to do my job for me? Oh, you won't do it very well. Okay. Well, the expert is combining my sugar and butter to make a nice paste. I'm going to crack one egg. What's the crack? <laughs> What's the crack, fellas? This right here is the powder that Tess very kindly sent me. Now, I know for a fact there's probably about five, five grams of this powder. How much shall I add? I'm not going to measure it. I don't know. So it came in... Like a tiny bit. Isn't it hot? It is hot, yeah. It came in these little sachets um, that you put seeds to, which is great because it means I've got more of them now. <laughs> um, yeah, so that's about. I've used some of it. I, I would say that's not enough for these cookies. I want them to be actually hot, like. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, 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 I get it, but like. This one's quite full, isn't it? Did you say? That's full. From the top to bottom. Yeah, it is. So what I'm going to do is, I'm just going to show you how mad I am. Right. Ready for this? No, but it smells hot. Yeah, it does. Yeah. They're going to be inedible. They won't be inedible. So I've got my laptop set up so I can actually see what's in focus, which is really helpful. Now as you can see, I've used pretty much the whole bag. And you can see it in the bowl there. That's uh, it smells really hot, doesn't it? <coughs> when you cook it. <coughs> Thanks. Thanks, Tess. <coughs> I already had a cough. <laughs> when I cook. <laughs> yeah, when you cook. <coughs> you can't 
done too right there. <coughs> When you cook, you just chuck everything over there. <laughs> uh, I can't, so. It looks like when you, when you mix tomato sauce with mashed potato. I would never do that, personally. I did that when I was little. I'll take your word for it. <coughs> <laughs> when you cook, you don't follow the recipe. You just chuck everything in together. So. I don't believe in reading <coughs> the mess. I only believe in reading the ingredients. Um, it will all eventually end up in the same place, so why not just why not just get on with it? <coughs> There's no flaw in your logic. Just for the camera. And bring it over. It looks like red mashed potato. I, I think that's accurate. It really smells <coughs> though. It stinks. What does the the rub? Ah. I'm trying to work out the angles here. Oh, it's because it's mirrored, isn't it? Yeah, it's really awkward. But yeah, you can you can see. It I looks think. like baby food. Do you say baby food or like you said when you mix uh, mashed potato in with um, tomato, tomato sauce? sauce yeah. <coughs> Still making me cough. Thanks, Tess. That is absolute evil powder. Oh boy! Absolutely delicious though. Definitely very hot. But I think actually that's just the right amount of spice. So I'll do about half into this. Does it say to do it slowly? No. No. Okay, well. Just put the egg in. That looks fucking horrible. Oh no, it looks like. <laughs> it looks like the foreign and cook It looks like Starbucks did a pumpkin spice lamp. Mine looks like scrambled egg. Yeah, it does. It's because it's curdled because we added the eggs too quickly. But that's okay. When we add the drying ingredients, that'll come out. They just haven't mixed it. Yeah. And you're mixing it too much. Yeah. Is that some shell? Oh my god. Can I get some yeah, shell in there? Really <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, we need 200 millilitres of flour. Because that's a measurement. What, in each bowl? <laughs> no, in total. So 100 Yeah, 100 in each bowl, yeah. I can't tell what's making me cough, whether it's my cold or whether it's this powder from Tess. Lot. Yeah, it was a lot, but I think that's about right. How much is this? Uh, I, I put in like two halves, so yeah, two of what you just did. Yeah. So I would just like to take this opportunity to point out the difference in colour between these. Um, this one's looking horrifying, and yours is looking like me. Um, should we put the chocolate in as well? Yeah. That's enough. Sure? Yeah. Otherwise it's just going to be too chocolatey. Oh, finished. I'll bring that over to the camera. So it still doesn't have the raisins in it yet, but like... That's what mine looks like. Hold on, let me get to that. It's still very orange. It looks more yellow. It's like a peachy colour. Yeah. Right, I'm going to turn the heat off on these now. It smells great. It smells like some caramelised at the bottom. Yeah. Strain that off, and yeah. What rum boring. did you use? I don't even know what rum we've got. Uh, it's like the spice rum. The spice. Yeah. <coughs> Show the camera what we got. What we're dealing with. Raisins. Yeah, just you know, it looks like. Well, it just fell. Yeah. Basically, that's the best view I can get. It's got a couple of uh, white fatali peppers in there. Oh, just one actually. Uh, just to give it a bit of heat. Because, you know, if there's one thing that my cookie's going to be lacking in, it's going to be heat, right? So I've got my raisins and they've, they've cooled down to room temperature now, or thereabouts. I'm not sure how, how much capacity the dough has for raisins, so I'm just going to add a few more. If it's too much. Then. Can I put a few more in? Wait. Yeah, because I'm not. I'm not sure what the ratio of dough to raisin should look like. It doesn't matter, it is personal preference. Yeah. Mm. 
Yeah, this is looking fantastic. This is going to be like a family favourite. Just not with the cheese. Not, not, <laughs> not this orange one. Yeah. <laughs> the orange ones are a Halloween favourite. If you enjoy dying when you eat. I do. Right, so you you said that like you think they're just designed to be plucked up. Yeah, they are. They're drop cookies. I think is, the, is that a thing? That's the term that they, they use. Looks so much like you know when you have those selection dips and there's that <laughs> orange one yeah. that no one yeah. likes. Yeah, I like that one. That Halloween cookies, all right. You also look like Remy dog shit. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that mad? We need to stop giving Halloween decorations out. We don't decorate for Halloween. Okay, well, we need to start. Why? If we don't do Halloween. <laughs> we did last year, that was fun. I was Freddie Mercury. You were Freddie Mercury and I was a cow. And you were a cow. <laughs> Just like every other day of the year. <laughs> do that here. This is a flex on Americans. Mmm. Raw egg. Oh. <laughs> so. Instant salmonella. <coughs> oh my god. This is good dough without that shit. Is it? Yeah. Good. Hold on, let me let me show the camera. See, that's so good. Oh my god, they look even more yellow <laughs> on the camera. That was almost uh On camera, they definitely look like, oh, I should take my dog to the vet <laughs> right now. <laughs> yeah, they do. No, it's good. Very hot, actually, with that powder in. Mine, uh, mine look green on camera, but they're just nice and normal colour. Um, yeah, mine are the basic bitch kind, <laughs> and those are the dog shit kind. Yeah. Sounds good. Let's get them in the oven, shall we? What are we going to do next time? <laughs> Let's be honest, there probably won't be another video for another six months. <laughs> You've still got one you haven't edited. Yeah. That's the eating bubble Batman bubble bitch seven. I see. We'll come back in ten minutes and actually try them on camera and stuff. Once they're cooked. Once they're cooked, yeah. Not just me eating raw cookie dough. Say bye. Bye. Um, they've just come out of the oven. Uh, well, they've cooled. They, and they've cooled down. So yeah, that's how mine look. They don't really look very orangey anymore. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely a bit paler. Yours were on top though, so you might have like darkened up a little bit. Yeah, really good. Do you want to break it in half? Yes, please. So oh wow, it does actually look quite different inside on camera anyway. Yeah, thank you. Ugh. They're still pretty soft. Like they get yeah. a bit hard. They have like the texture of great more cakey on the bottom. Mm. Mm. They're good? That's good. There's like a tiny bit of spice at the end. Yeah, from the raisins. Mm, that's it was good. good. Well, is it? <laughs> I don't know, you tell me. It's fine. That no, good. Good. Mm. So, I'm going to be trying some of mine. Look at that, it smells. It smells really like peppery and chocolatey. It smells really good. I'm just gonna. Mm. Oh my god, that's great. Is it hot? Mm. There's not much heat to it. Just kidding, there's actually a lot of heat. Oh. It's warming my whole mouth up. To the point where I'm actually on fire right now. Like the back of my throat, it's like I've eaten a slice of pepper. Hopefully it doesn't get any worse than this. 
Maybe you should have made smaller cookies. Should have made smaller cookies. <laughs> <laughs> but no, that, this is actually really nice. It, the taste is like, it's like slightly peppery. Like you can slightly taste the pepper, but the taste of the cookie itself is definitely made a lot better by that. It's definitely rum and raisin. It's like rum and raisin and, and hell, and this is a really good cookie. I'll keep eating it. Mm. It needs those chocolate chunks in there. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. It needs those chocolate chunks in there. Because they help to mellow out the heat. But yeah, my whole mouth is on fire. Mm. 